The Rio Grande Valley sector leading the nation in narcotic seizures. Just this morning in McAllen, a 1,000 pound load of marijuana seized by Border Patrol. News Center 23's Joanna Guzman has more. That's right, Brenda. The Southwest Border Patrol accounts for more than 40% of marijuana and cocaine seizures. The Rio Grande City is the busiest station in the nation. Officials say it's an area often used by smugglers due to the lack of infrastructure and limited technology in the area. These smugglers will utilize various methods to try to get their narcotics across. They'll use rafts, they'll come across with the bundles on their back uh, using makeshift uh, flotation devices. They've even uh, ferried vehicles across loaded that were previously loaded in Mexico um, and drive those on the U.S. side. Border Patrol agents say while they have seen a decrease in marijuana seizures between 2017 and 2018, they have also seen an increase in cocaine seizures. Unfortunately, these transnational criminal organizations are still uh, taking advantage of the juveniles in the area and they're using them and exploiting them to carry out these smuggling events. Agents in the Rio Grande Valley sector are currently working with local, state and federal partners assuring that every case gets prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Brenda? Joanna, thank you. Officials urge the community to report any suspicious activity to authorities.